Sonia. Hi, Nancy. Hello. It's so good to see you. It's so good to see you, my dear. It is so wonderful. It's been too long. I know. It's sort of like we went into the vortex and, and now we're coming out the other side and, and we're ready for something fun and fresh, aren't you? Yes, I am. And I know you've got it because your master class is launching soon. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited about it because the master class is, first of all, it's the, the summary of my life's work, but I really think that it's what brings magic back to people's lives quickly. And we need that right now. The world needs to remember we're magicians that we can create, that we can manifest and we can we don't have to just sit and expect the world to 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 bring it to us. I, that's what this this period of time is for everybody. I think we're feeling ready for that. And we've had enough disappointment that nothing's bright coming our way that we want to just take the take the reins and, and start bringing about our own beauty and magic. And that's what the master class is about. Right. OK, so the master class is, I think, your seminal work of all yeah. of your amazing work that you put out into the universe all of your books and all of your courses and all of your teachings and wisdoms this master class which is called your glorious life perfect title because <laughs> it's because it encapsulates everything right it really is your it's like the sum total of your beautiful wisdom and your all your teachings well here's the thing nancy i have been teaching people it kind of evolved first i started teaching people that we have six senses, but there was more. And then I wanted to let them know that we have help. We have spiritual help. We have divine helpers, lots of help. And that we need that help. There's no point. Why struggle alone when you have a, a whole universe of assistance that's ready, willing, and able to participate? So then I wanted to take the veil back on that. Okay, so we have great intuition. We have great help. But for what reason? That is to create. To, that's what makes us happy and joyful, gives our lives purpose. So we take this heightened awareness and this, this support system of divine energy, and we begin to just channel it into the world to create a glorious life. And, and that's not only what makes our own experience beautiful, but it is what we contribute to the world. So it's sort of the gift that keeps on giving and I really have come to understand after 45 years. So it's, it's the whole point. It's like, this is why we're here. This is what we're here to learn. And this is what I love teaching. It's what I, what I, what, what, what makes my life glorious is to give everybody else the paint brushes and tools to have their own experience of glorious life. You know, you know what I love the way you talk about how this, this course, this masterclass is like a dance that we're doing with the universe. Right. It's like you're and each one of the lessons is like a dance step. And when, you know, when I was listening to the first lesson um, just last night, I, I was I was swept away all over again with that idea of like, oh, this is easy and fun. It's meant to be fun. Right. Absolutely. First of all, I don't think we create anything if we get too petty. We need to be embodied. We need to feel our emotions. We need to feel the energy between our hands, the life force that's really pulsing through us. And everything in the universe is sound vibration and rhythm. So when you get connected to your rhythm, your true inner voice sound, your inner voice frequency, your highest vibration, you do start dancing with the universe. You, be, you get swept into this, this beautiful rhythmic frequency that goes, it's like a spiral, higher and higher. And, and it's like a centrifugal force. It expands outward. So you feel it. That's what I love about teaching the glorious life is you don't have to believe me. You feel it. And what I do is I have learned to transmit that energy and jump started in you so you actually kind of get reconnected to the sound and the vibration and the frequency of your divine self yeah. and 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 it's like turning a light on in a dark room and going oh 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 my oh wow and then really getting excited again about what who you are and what's possible for you and and how you you said the right word how easy it is 
I actually, that is the big secret. I am not over promising. If you know the steps and you know how to turn on the light and hear the, the frequency and sense it and listen with your whole body, it does. Not only the reason we even say the word easy is because as you felt it yesterday, it's natural. It's natural. I'm activating something in you. I'm not trying to put something in you. I'm, I'm activating and engaging you, re-engaging you with that life force in you, that spirit in you that wants to create. And you know, because it's natural and easy and fun, everybody can do it. It's like that, that was really what struck me as I was going through, you know, because I was your student last year for this, for the yeah. life. I, I was your, I was in the front row with my <laughs> books out and doing my interactive workbook and I loved it and it changed everything. It really did. But as I was going through the materials again last night, I was struck again by how it's like, it's immediate. Like that first exercise where you, you bring us home, you know, you take us to our heart center and bring us home. And I thought to myself, oh my gosh, every, every single person can do this and we'll feel better within the first moments of the course. Well, that's my goal is I want people to, to heal. I think creating the glorious life is a healing. I think that it calls pieces of you back into play, re-empowers you, it shifts your, your locus of, of my, my sense of who I am back to your heart. And that's your, your most powerful center. And it really, you begin to experience the, the natural trust that you can have in your heart that you just can't have in your head because your head is a noisy and, and, and it's, it's full of everybody else's intrusions and it, the, the, the kind of the broadcast of the world, but the heart space is a clear channel. And it really reconnects you back to your authentic self. And I know how to do this because I've been doing it for 50 years, teaching it publicly around the world, believe it or not, for 40 years and in all kinds of countries. So I've studied and fine tuned and, and, and came up with universal tools instead of what would might work in this culture or that group or so I've taken it down to the, the bottom line of who we are as humans, but divine humans, divinely empowered humans, and show us how to have a, a divine experience in our human journey. And I, I just, plus I love fun. If yeah. it's not fun, you're not going to do it. If you I can't agree. make it fun, and I also think if you don't get pretty quick results, you're going to get bored and get back in your head and say, forget it. So I teach in a way where you, each moment you, you, you have an experience, you have affirmation, something changes with every single lesson. So let's just talk about the, talk about the masterclass for a second. So people listening can get a sense of what it is because it is a comprehensive lesson, right? It's, 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 it's yeah. 36 different videos, right? And yes. six, six lives, six live moments with you. Right, six hour, weekly hours. And we, I get together once in a week. Well, here's what I've done. First of all, I've studied how people learn. And we cannot learn with, with, with huge chunks. Right. We learn in bite sizes that we can, we can experiment with and get a result. So I have a lesson a day for six weeks. And it's broken into three parts that graduate. So the first two weeks, I teach you every day a short lesson in how to activate your intuition, how to get your intuitive intelligence operating for you. You know, about 20 years ago, Dan Goleman came up with the idea that we have an emotional intelligence. Well, this is the next octave. Now it's like from our emotional intelligence, we can jump up to our intuitive intelligence. We have this. And so I teach you how to turn it on how to start understanding your own, because it's not one size fits all, how to understand and kind of experience your own intuitive intelligence. And the way do it is with each lesson, you get some evidence. So you're not just hoping this works. You get actual instant feedback and you begin to see this is reliable, this works. Then from there, I evolve into the next two weeks where I start to introduce you. This is the super fun part to your spiritual support system. I remember when you discovered yours and we just was like, woohoo, this is just amazing because it life is. Life-changing. 
it, it, you know, we don't realize that we have helpers and they're ready, willing and able and not just one or two, you know, we don't, it's not just like, oh, I have a guardian angel or I have maybe a little spirit guide. We have a whole universe of helpers that will help you with, with all kinds of things. We have joy guides and healers and teachers and, and practical helpers and runners and archangels and the, the ministry of angels. And, and so I explain all of that, show you how to connect with them and show you how to get evidence, quick evidence that they are on the job. That's the fun part. So pretty soon your life goes from me slogging through the world to all of a sudden, that's where the dance picks up. We start like I'll move in, ask for some help, and then I get it, and I get the fun result, and I get the evidence, and I get the the, the, the inexplicable, inexplicable synchronicity, and and that makes me laugh, and then my heart opens, and it just cascades into this whole different frequency. I say it's like going from AM radio to satellite. You know, all of a sudden we are receiving on all these channels instead of just listening to our own head. So that's the second week, the second two weeks. And then the third two weeks, I say, okay, we have all this. Right. Let's put it to work. Let's start getting it moving in the direction to manifest for us the things we would love to make our lives really extraordinary, really glorious. Like getting in the flow, synchronicity, right place, right time, attracting help, seeing openings that we that our intellect never even recognized or thought were possible. It's just like pulling the curtains back and all of a sudden entering Wonderland. And I'm I honestly I'm not overpromising. You begin to create because you understand how it works and that you're not doing it alone or working out of your ego. You're working out of your spirit with your spirit helpers. So it's just fun. It's just fun, fabulous. And I've been teaching so long, I really distilled it down to the essence. Not a lot of words. Oh my Not God. a lot of, yeah. you know, just, be, just get to the point. Sonia, this is one of the things I love about the way you teach this course is that you're right. It, they, they are little beautiful chunks, little nuggets. And you're absolutely right. I don't want to sit down for hours and hours, right? At a time, I, I want you to give me some of that glimmering goodness. And, and then I want to go and experiment with it. I want to go play with it in my life. It's like a, a cup of magic to go every day. That's how I like to see it. And just like you love your cup of coffee to go or your cup of tea, your cup of magic, you sip on all day and you just keep refreshing yourself with the experience. Frankly, I just don't know how anyone can have a good experience of life without understanding and using the tools I'm bringing. I, I just don't see how, if you're just stuck in your head, you can have anything but a, a, a stressful, fearful experience. It's like trying to fumble. You, have you ever been in a blackout in your own home? Mm -hmm. yeah, have you ever been? You're watching and all of a sudden they're whatever the, right. it's a blackout and you just get scared and it's like okay everybody don't move and you start inching around and you're e even in your own home you're like super scared and everything you touch you overreact and yeah and you hold your breath and and then the lights come back on and you're like oh i'm in my i'm in the safety and the and the and the security of my own beautiful home and glorious life is like turning the lights on in the blackout yeah. And showing you the world you actually can live in is not only safe, it's beautiful. And what people really, what I want to convey more than anything is that the universe wants you to have a beautiful life. And the more of us who have a beautiful life, the more infectious we become for the others. And we be also, not only do you create your own beautiful experience, you become the guide, the leader, the teacher, the activator for those around you. So it's the gift that spreads. And I really feel this is how we uplift the, the, the planet. We need to uplift and the best way to do it, my teacher said the best way to help the miserable is don't be one of them. Right. And that's what this is about. It's like, yeah. I'm not gonna be one of the miserable waiting for something to happen. I'm gonna be the magician creating the beauty, the color, the magic, the, 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 the opportunity and it is, the natural way.
it's actually easier to have a glorious life than it is to have a miserable one. That's the big magic of what I'm teaching. Yes, because you teach us how to get in the flow of it. I mean, I feel like right now more than ever, first of all, you're absolutely right. Let's let's lift up the collective experience of humanity right now. We never needed it more, right? So this is a beautiful right. moment to become a beautiful, abundant creator. And also what I see, and I think, do you, do you agree that this is kind of a moment for so many people they feel like they're on the precipice. They want to create something new in their lives. Like this to me is creative fuel. I feel like we are at a tipping point. And one of the things that I'm excited about teaching this work, this class this year, is that in response to the great resignation, you know, we've talked about everybody's just fed up with the old way. They know in their bones. It's not just about, I don't like my job. It's like, I don't like the way I'm told I have to live my life. And I'm speaking to that. It's like, of course you don't have to live that way. And yes, I support you, you rejecting that. And let me show you what you can do differently because there's something in you looking for that. And so this is a, this is a complete convergence, a, a beautiful timing to respond yeah. to this global intuitive sense that there's a better way than being bullied and, 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 and just completely demoralized day after day. Of course there is. And this, the way I'm teaching the glorious life is I'll show you the better way and you'll have evidence yourself yes. and re, re, you'll have reflections quickly. So you will feel it, not think it, right. you will experience it, not hope. Right. It starts shifting immediately and I just feel so passionate about my devotion to teaching people how to use all their gifts and powers and how to recall in all their help and, and create a life that is beautiful so that they are part of the, the solutions of the planet and the inspiration and the healing of the planet. And you know what I think that, you know what I think this, this teaching gives us too? The confidence to go after our dreams. Because when you're following your intuition, as you're talking about, and when you're calling on all the help, all the cooperative elements of, of, of your guides, you know, you, you are infused with the confidence. You are infused with the knowing of, yes, I can do this. And I feel like right now people need that. People are, you know, kind of built with self-doubt. Well, here's the thing. If we live from the identity that we are just our ego, mm -hmm. which is the first thing I address and change and teach you that you are spirit and your ego is your helper. Yeah. The ego is never going to be confident because it's not powerful. Right. It's always threatened. And the ego part of you is temporary. And so the confidence comes from tuning into the power of who you really are, the spirit of you, the, the life force that makes your heart beat, that brings you alive, that makes your consciousness sink and your body grow. It's miraculous. Mm -hmm. And when we begin to shift, as you say, to that heart understanding of who we are and live from that point of view and live from that truth, confidence comes naturally. And you'll never get it in your ego. It's the ego is not ever going to give you confidence because it's by nature a threatened aspect of our, of our lower self that will never, ever change. But what we can do and what I teach you is how to get your ego to support your spirit instead of fight it. Yes. And that's the, the, that is the dynamic. That is the way it should be. Einstein said it. The human spirit is your sacred gift and the rational mind its faithful servant. So when you let the rational mind, so when your intuition says, let's do this, your mind says, yes, let's, how, let's do it. I'll help you. That, that begins to integrate these, this, this part of you that for a lot of people battles head and heart, they become partners. And with that partnership, things take off and you're not conflicted. You become confident and congruent. That's what you feel whole again. You're in your you're in your divine kind of the way you're designed to be. And that's where that confidence comes from. Because I feel like we are all really meant for that. that that's, that's our birthright, right? We are yes. meant to have intuitive, confident, glorious lives. And I feel like when you're in your head all the time, and I mean, you taught me this. If you're in your head all the time, you're closing yourself off. 
from all that life force. You, you know that when you're in your head, the, your ego self has sort of this filter on it, which is me against the world and the world scares me, I put up my blocks, I'm gonna isolate myself and you get cut off from your life force. When you're in your spirit, you begin to look around and see, the, not only see, feel, sense, know, you're connected. And you're connected to this beautiful life force that, that will lift you up and support you and, and, and carry you to what is congruent and what matches what it is you want to create. And you have divine helpers. Yes. That's the part that really changes the equation. You, are, you have a whole team of support. And when you begin to let that be part of your reality, honest to God, you, you almost will think you entered Wonderland because so much changes so fast and there's so much, there's so much affirmation. I had, a, I had a woman take the glorious life and she was, she just gotten a new job and her job was incentive-based sales. And one of the, the, the incentives was a red Mustang. And she said, I thought I want that red Mustang. I never was in sales before. I was working as a hairdresser, but I want this red Mustang. And she used the principles and she kept, you know, just saying to her guides, I want the red Mustang. And every time she turned around, she would come at a corner. She says, who's these red Mustangs? That is not, that's a vintage car, right? That's not even, but she kept running into a red Mustang here, seeing one on the road there, turning the TV on, seeing one in a movie. Well, guess what? She won the red <laughs> Mustang. She said it was a group experience. I had so many helpers and now I am woo-hoo. I am beep, beep in the red Mustang. Who knew? She said, I was one of those people who was sort of the beige person in the room, you know, kind of blended it, didn't attract attention to myself. And here I am coming through it. I just loved, I live for these stories. I live for these kinds of, these kinds of affirmations that you're right. Everybody can have this if you learn how. Yeah. And as you've said, you don't teach dance lessons going, you do this and this and this and this and this. It's like you do this step, then you do this step, then you do this step, then you listen to the music and you do these three steps and then you add a few more. And pretty soon you just find what I call your mojo. You find yeah. your rhythm, you find yeah. your spirit and you get swept away. And yeah. it is the only way to live. I'm teaching people not something to do. I actually am teaching a way of life. I was just going to say that you're not teaching just, yes, you're teaching steps, but then the steps become a beautiful waltz, right? And you feel oh. your way through it and you learn the skills how to do that. So everything that you're teaching us is a foundation of how to live this life in the flow. And you're right. When you start tapping into your divine guidance system, your divine helpers, literally everything changes. I mean, I got married five months ago, yes. found the love of my life. I'm 58 years old, he's 58 years old. We found each other because I just started tapping into that intuitive knowingness of this was meant for me and I am going to receive it. You, you have to be in the receiving mode for it. And here's the other thing I know about teaching which is why I set the course up the way I did. I will actually meet you once a week in, a, in an hour long live. So we go over what we've learned this week. And I set it up that you work in little groups yourselves. So you teach each other because if we can work with others, we help each other. One moment you're the student and maybe in the group, you get to be someone to help someone else. It reinforces it. We can't just watch it and hope we have to keep putting it in in different interactive ways. So this working with yourself day by day, working with me, working with each other reinforces it. And I was, I was in touch with quite a few people who took the glorious life last year and their small group that they worked with have become their best friends. I'm sure. Yes. Because they've had such bonding and magnificent breakthrough experiences with one another. Yeah. So I'm, I was like, so delighted that that is a, a secondary gain is you get a tremendous magical community of your own buddies, your own, what I call your believing eyes that are working with you and cheering you on. So you're not doing this alone, not 
not through the, the, the physical selfish of your spirit guides, but also I create the support system in this world that we need too. So you really, you really have backup in every which direction. And that, because I do know how to teach and I do and have studied how people learn yeah, and how to help them learn successfully. And I think that's so important to be around like-minded people who are all looking for that same rise in energy, right? Yeah. And so you need that. You need to, to, to lift each other up. That, that community of upliftment is so important to keep your momentum going and to keep your intuitive fires burning, right? It's a wonderful thing. And you learn from each other, like you said. We, we actually need a little bit of a, of a reinforcement with one another because yeah. people who aren't committed to a glorious life, there's a lot of um, negativity and a lot of demoralization. There's a lot of people who will, who will try to take you down because that's all they know. So if you're surrounded by the people who are working and championing you, then you are resilient and a bit immune to all that because you're having too much fun. That's right. And, and you all you all believe in the truth of my intuition is helping to guide me. I'm tapping into something much bigger than myself. We are all tapping into something much bigger than ourselves. It's like plugging yourself into a to an endless source of energy and light and beauty and fun. And you want to do it with people. You want to share the joy. And you know the best part, as you work with one another, you have evidence. So yeah. it's not and staying in the belief mode as you come together week after week you say this thing happened and this happened and this happened and this happened and this happened so it builds a momentum of confirmation and then you become invincible then you are you're committed to this new way of life yeah. i just think that we inevitably as a species are going this direction anyway so why get on the slow train when you can get on the the super powered rocket and get there right now i mean i feel like intuitively we're all more receptive even more now than even a year ago mm -hmm. saying i'm i'm ready I, I i'm ready to to actually be more empowered i feel it i i i feel and I, I really want to speak to that part of you that that even landed here in this conversation, because I think this is this is a, re, a reflection of your looking and your guides and your higher self and your intuition bringing you even to this conversation. Oh, yeah. And you know what? When you're ready, you know it. You know it mm -hmm. in your heart. Even if your head doesn't know it yet, you feel the pull right? You feel like I want more. I want, I want more and I want to create and I want to manifest. I want to get the things that I just know are going to bring me so much happiness. And you're right. You start seeing evidence of it right away. And you know what? The great tool of this masterclass among all the tools is that amazing 140 page interactive workbook that I am obsessed with. I love that thing so much. Your <laughs> questions, that workbook is everything. I mean, I just love it. I love reading over it again and again and again. It's like my journal of discovery. You know? You know what I'd say about that workbook? It becomes the best book you'll ever read. Ah! Because it becomes the book of your successes. It is the book of, uh, that will reflect your, your experience of becoming a true magician of your own life. That's, that's what I think the workbook is, is it's, you, it is the tracking of your own evolution and empowering abilities. And it, and you're right, you can go over it and over it and over it. And it's, it's like a little kind of how to be magical and glorious without fail book. So I love that you mentioned this good, this workbook and I also created, because I know we learn on all these different channels, so we have to reinforce every one. The workbook, you, you engage your mind and your body and your writing and you, your conversations with your group and, and the lessons and you're your, your hearing them. And also have meditations mm -hmm. that are channeled that speak to each one of the, of the arcs that I'm helping you activate, the intuitive arc, the work with the guides, the manifestation arc. And I channel these so the, 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 when, what you hear and what you embody wakes up and, and, and engages that part of you. So they, these, are, these are pretty powerful meditations. It is one of my skills to channel and transmit 
through the meditations, what I'm talking about. So you actually feel no. the, the energy. energy. These are, these meditations are journeys. You call them, you yes. say, these are meditative journeys. This isn't a small little meditation. This is, no. something, it's, like, it's like you immerse yourself in the meditation, like just lowering yourself into a warm bath. It is so amazing. It's so immersive. They're about 45 minutes long. And one of the things that they do is they really do take you into the dimensions of power. I'm taking you from being what I call a third dimension, dense ego focused being to a fifth dimension, expansive energetic being. And the meditations are the, these, these journeys literally activate and elevate your frequency so you experience this expanded you so you can that you listen to them every night you can fall asleep to them you can wake up to them but they really get into your cellular body and into your subconscious mind and into your belief system and kind of open it up so they are life-changing as well yeah and you know i think that it's, it's a really great habit and something I've been doing for, for many, many months. Instead of the minute I wake up starting to look at my phone and scrolling through my screen and, and getting very distracted and getting right back in my head and in my ego, instead, I listen to your meditative journey. I close my eyes and I have that moment. And it's like setting an intention for the day. It's setting an intention to be a receiver, right? And yeah. then my whole day changes, Sonia. My whole day is different. Yeah. I, I mean, it, it is. I love that. That's the intention. They're like vacations. Yes. They're actually, they're, they, they take you into a higher dimension and, and let you live in a flow. You, you definitely set the energy for the day. And there's a beautiful Chinese saying from the book of changes called the I Ching. The way it begins is the way it ends. And so beginning your day with this just creates and attracts a vibrational mirroring of what you're setting up and so many things happen another I, I should just tell you another client of mine she wanted to have the experience she said I want a vacation I take vacations um, in your journeys but she was working the glorious life and she said I want a vacation and I just I just can't seem to to figure out how I can make that happen and one of the clients that she was coaching said, you've done such a good job. I want to send you on vacation <laughs> and gave her a vacation, said, invite whoever you want. You have to take a fresh truck. So, so it actually was like, you're kidding. Okay, let's do this. So that was just another example of you stop figuring out and yeah. you just begin to be receptive. As you said, you begin to open up to the possibility that this can, this can happen without me being on all the dials all the time. It's a partnership with the universe bringing in components that I didn't even know existed. And they, they want to help and support and celebrate me. And this, it works. I've been teaching oh, yeah. for my whole life. I've been studying, refining, learning, watching what tools work, what doesn't. And this is... What I have defined here in the Inglorious Life is, is really a reliable process, a yeah. no-fail process and that I, helps you shift your life permanently for the better. Yep. And what I love about it is I like to return to it, right? Because, because the videos are so, are such chunks of, you know, beautiful nuggets and not these lengthy, lengthy diatribes. There's just these gorgeous little nuggets crystallized. I return to the to the videos again and again. I return to the workbook again and again. You know, no matter what's going on in my life, I I, I that's kind of my my home now, right? Like all these. I love that home. you do that because this it works like a spiral. So you yeah. do it once and you create certain things, and then you do it again. You create and it's a process on how to live. So you keep getting better and better at it. So. You, you know, and you do get the course for life. So you can continually go back. And and one, one twirl through will bring you plenty of magic. But every time you go do it again, you work on mastery. Yeah. So you begin to master creating a glorious life with each revisiting of the process. And it's, it's as if in many ways, you're learning it all over again. Because each time you revisit it, you're a different person from when you learned it the first time. Yeah. Right, because life changes, right? 
And you know, exactly. uh, you know, two years ago, uh, when I when I when I started thinking about it, gosh, I'd love to fall in love again. Gosh, well, here I am. Now I'm madly in love and married and happy. Well, now I've got a whole host of new things that I desire. And so, because you're a dynamic person, your life changes all the time. And I love to go back to my glorious life teachings because it helps me jumpstart that intuition for the next round of things that I want. You know, it's like a tool that I use always. That is exactly the way I designed this course to be so that it can be available to you and you keep going back and you keep working the principles. You get better at them. You get, you get more clear. You start creating faster. You start creating bigger. You start, you start allowing yourself more because you have to learn to, to experience the goodness of life. You have to adjust to how good can you stand it? It's like, I, was thought, I almost thought of calling it that, how good can you stand it? And you, you actually have to kind of grow into yes. allowing your life to get better and better. But I actually believe that that is the best thing we can do to help this planet is to learn to create beautiful lives and let ourselves accept, believe and dedicate ourselves to letting that be what I deserve, what is my birthright, what is, what, what is why I'm here and there are no blocks and, and, and I'm going to do it. That's right. And I'm going to do it for me and I'm going to do it for the world and I'm going to do it for my world. And that's my contribution in terms of being part of the solutions of what's wrong with this picture in the, on, in the world right now. Like there's nothing wrong with mine. I'm showing you that it can be, life can be good. And that gives the people around you inspiration, hope, guidance, and you can teach them. That's even another thing that's so exciting about this. Once you learn just by the way you do your life, people learn from you. Well, you know, and that's why I love that you're launching this masterclass right now. I mean, the timing is so perfect. So, so it, you know, you're, you're launching it on, on March 10th, right? Yes. So March 10th is the, is the day and, and, you know, doors are only going to be open until the 20th. So, and you're not going to offer this again for at least a year. So this is, and I think that you picked exactly the right moment in time. This is when people are ready. Like we were saying earlier, everyone's on the precipice of wanting change, of wanting more hope, more inspiration, more creative fuel. So I think you picked March 10th is like a, a gorgeous, gorgeous moment for all of us to say yes to that to, and to say yes together. It's a tipping point. I think we're all feeling that if we can work collectively together and I open this window. So those who really are ready show up. And so it's kind of a vibrational match among all of us that we are a, a solidified community because we're going to help each other, not just me helping you, but we're helping each other. And then we become a force. Yeah. And so this window says, okay, if you're feeling it, trust that. Don't waste time, show up, step in, yes. give it a go, and 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 let's do this. Let's let's not sit on the fence any longer. I mean, life keeps marching by. So either you jump in and you you create a magnificent experience or you choose not to. So I am I open the window so people who are ready to do this yes. jump in. And Definitely. then we, we take off. We are off and running and it right. it and we don't have to, we're not pulling teeth or fighting anybody's resistance. We are all working together. And that's part of the magic of how it works. Right. And it does require you to work for it. You, you, have, you have to be committed to it. In fact, the very first page of the workbook, you sign your commitment. I signed my name. I remember it. I love signing my name and dating it and saying, this is the day. This is the day today as I sign this commitment that I'm showing up for myself. I am showing up for my dreams. I'm showing up for the glorious life that I want to create. And you're right. Like, let's all move into that moment together. Boom. Here we go. March 10th. And I love it. I feel like right now we are moving into a period of time where we are saying, I choose self-love. I choose creativity. I choose personal empowerment. I intuitively am rejecting a lot of things in life that don't work for me, but that's only half the process. Take and grab on to the things that will take you to what will work for you. And I feel like my whole life I have been in preparation for this moment in time so that we can really shift and uplift quickly and, and, and dynamically in a, in a 
big way so that not only do each person who comes to work with me, you also become a force of light and good in the world. And we need you. We so need this is honestly a calling. And if you feel that on any level, I'm a good teacher. You'll have a good experience and you will love who you discover you are. And you know what? Can I just also take a moment to honor you about something? You have made, you, you are a believer that this is for everyone and that we need everyone to do this. You have priced this masterclass so affordably, Sonia. It's so, I mean, $555 for, for the wealth of knowledge that you are bringing and for the tools and strategies to use to create a, a life of your dreams. Well, I, you know, honestly, I work with a lot of clients. I work and I've done a lot of master classes. Okay. I, cause I love, I love that whole, the whole, I love that we're all teaching each other something, but you have priced this so affordably, Sonia, you really have. And I really honor that. I, I thank you for that. For, the, for I everyone. really feel very called to create an, an opening for everyone who wants it. Yeah. So I have created a, an education and an evolution that doesn't that will not exclude anyone and that's always been my nature so i do feel like that's why i created the a price that i that people can really manage without stressing their lives out and that's important to me so that you are fully on board when you step in so thank you for acknowledging that because it is part of the universe will gift you if you're ready Things will open up for you if you're ready. And that's just the beginning. You can grow without it compromising or causing you um, anxiety or stress, right? So that's part of it. It's, it's a stress-free invitation that, you know, is, is affordable, is rich, and is immediate. Like, the, I, you know, my, the first lesson, I, as I told you, I went back and listened to it again last night just to, because I knew that we were talking today. And I was like, oh, right out of the gate. You're, I'm, we're like, <laughs> I'm naming my spirit. I'm naming my barking dog. I understand. I'm like, woo. <laughs> well, I just feel like inherently we on a cellular level, we know that we are divine beings. We, we know, not think, we know that there's, there's more magic to my life and more assistance to my world than, than anybody has necessarily shared with me. So I speak to you in the course to the part of you that knows. Yeah. And it feels so good to say, oh my God, I've always wondered, I have felt this, but to actually have this be addressed as my most authentic self. So it's like, let's get on with this. You know, let's not, let's not, I don't give you a lot of intellectual blah, blah. We've had, there's plenty. There's plenty. I don't have patience for it. I'm a, I am a fire spirit. I am. Let's do this. Let's run with this. Let's go for it. Let's not waste time and let's have a good time. No, I know it, it, the, the <laughs> effects of, of, of your, your very first couple lessons are just like, I, I felt my heart. I literally felt myself opening. You say, you know, draw back the curtain open and I could feel myself opening up. And when, and when you feel that opening, you know what you also feel possibility. I'm like, yes. Yeah. What am I going to create next? You know, what's Isn't that fun? It's fun. It's fun. That is our natural way. That is how we are. That's how we are designed. That is who we are. And that's what, what our joy is and how we are designed to live. Yeah. So, so I am, this is my, my purpose. This is my passion. This is my vocation. This is my, my, my glorious life is teaching this to others. I just love it. Yeah. I love it. It's so, and, and you know what, and you love it. And I, and I, and I catch the energy of your love and I, and I, and I apply that to my life. And that really is how this works. And I feel like no matter who you are or where you are on your journey, whether you think you have every single thing you want, or you've got nothing you want, or you're in the middle somewhere, like most of us, there's always that spirit and that spark of new, of like, oh, what could, what could happen next? What's, what's around the corner? And when you start getting into your intuitive flow, that inner wisdom, that inner knowing, you start trusting that, yeah, I'm heading in the right direction. Yes, I'm exactly what I, where I need to be and where I need to be going. And I just feel like that it just infuses your whole life with happiness. It really does. I just, you just feel so comfortable. I so happy. I do think, and I, you know, I think what it does 
you tell me if you've experienced, I think it leaves you feeling peaceful. Oh yeah. And that is one of my goals is that you're not, a, you're not in an internal struggle. Right. So you become a peacemaker in the world because your vibration is harmonious. Your, your energy, your, your spirit is leading and you're, you're being who you are designed to be. You're living authentically. Your heart is open. You expect good things and you get them on a regular basis. You become generous and at ease because your life feels so abundant. You're not threatened. I mean, I just think it just ripples out in so many ways that, that, it, that I really call it a profound healing of spirit. It's the, it, it heals your life because the word healing means it makes you whole again. Yeah. And that's, that is something that I feel we all are called to, to move into now and we're ready for. So let's, let's go for this. We have so much divine help more than ever. More than ever, we have spiritual help that wants to participate. Even more than a year ago, we have helpers, guides, angels. They are lined up. They're Let's do it. Yeah, your whole support system is waiting, right? So, yes. Okay, so here you go again, March 10th. You're, you're launching this Glorious Life Masterclass, and you're offering it at a price that is so affordable, and that in itself is a gift, and the doors are only open for 10 days, but that yes. those are 10 divine days, Sonia. That's when you want everybody who's feeling called to this to say yes. Right, I'm, I'm not pulling teeth. I meet people in the middle. You step in, I'll meet you there. If your spirit, because I can't do more for you than you're willing to do for yourself, but I am able to really match you and take you on an incredible transformational journey if you will meet me there. And so, Step in, say yes, got nothing to lose. You'll have an instant experience, a transformational, a transformational experience. You really will become a, 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 the more authentic version of yourself who you'll fall in love with for sure. Oh, it's so great. Oh, my friend, it is so wonderful to chat with you. I love you so much. You know that. I just love you. Oh, so Nancy, much. just to see you again and chat with you and see all the beautiful creations in your marriage and your happy life and all the things that just transformed and you're working with your, your angels and your guides. And it, it makes me beyond happy. It's my, it, that is my reward. It, you know, and you were the one. You were the one who pulled back the curtain on all of that for me. You were, Sonia. And I remember the moment when it happened, when I, I, I felt it. I literally felt a shift in my whole vibration, in my life, in my soul, in my head, in my heart. And it was, it, it's, it's just been opening up, opening up ever since that moment. And I would just want that everyone to have that. I, I really, that is my heartfelt desire for everyone to feel that, that opening. Yeah, I'm so grateful to hear that, Nancy. That, and I just, I give you the biggest hug and, and celebrate you in every way. You are a magician. You are a glorious, beautiful flower on this planet. And thank you so much for, for helping me share this message and being part of this, this transformation on the planet. Thank you so much. Love you, Sonia. Love you, Nancy.